everybody welcome to soar from home with me lindsay and it is monday after a gloriously sunny weekend did everyone get outside i had a fun weekend uh we cleaned we spent time outside and then i spent the night making masks so it was great just a nice relaxing weekend which i needed how about you guys what did you do uh email me or reply in the comments below let me know what's going on did anybody garden I don't have a garden, so didn't do that. But let me hear, what did you do? Uh, did you stay in? Did you go out? Did you turn on the air conditioning? I had to, my house was like 78 degrees, it was so warm. All right, so today we are testing out Lindsay's acting skills. So what we're gonna be doing is playing charades and I am gonna be acting out 10 different things and you guys are gonna be guessing what they are. So that means grab your paper and grab your writing utensil. So pause the video and go grab those two items. Okay, label your paper one through 10. Pause the video if you need to. How this game is gonna work is I have three different categories of items uh, and I have little cards that have the different categories on them. And I have an extra in here. So I will hold the category and I'm gonna do all of the ones in that category. And I'm gonna act it out twice for you guys. So it's cause they're all pretty easy. Uh, I chose charades for kids because uh, I can't act that well. So regular charades uh, probably would have been too hard for me to act. So, all right, so hopefully you guys will get it and hopefully I'll be able to act these ones out. We'll see, we'll see how good I do. Okay, so the first three that we're gonna do, I'm gonna say which one they are, but, and I'll tell you when I switch categories. So the first three are gonna be in the category animal. Okay, animal. Number one. Number one, so now you're guessing. What do you guys think? Do you just wanna see me do that and be goofy again? Okay, this is my second impression of this animal. What do I got? What do I got going on? What do you guys think? Okay, that was number one. Number two, still in the category animal. Okay, number two. Ready? What do you guys think? Should I act some more? I'll do a little bit more. I'll try to, this is my second acting impression. Okay, what do you think I was? Hopefully that one went well. Now the third one. This one will be, I'll have the least amount of uh, actual acting going on. So you ready? This is the third one. Who has a nose like this? Number three. All right, now we're done with animals. Our next category is, they're over here. 
object. So now we're going to have two in the object category. So object, you know, is just like an item. It's a thing. Like a calendar could be an object or thread or paper. Okay, so the first object, which is number four, so you're on your guess number four. Okay, the object is Do you guys get it? Think of something. I'll give you one hint before I do number two. So plug your ears if you don't need a hint. It's a type of something you travel in. Okay? So, second, try it acting. All right, that was number four. Number five for, and this is still in the category object. Okay. Number five. Okay. What do you guys think that is? So I kind of looked at it. Then where did it go? Okay, do you guys get that? Number six starts us. So the whole second half is going to be, the last five are all gonna be in the action category. So an action is something you do, right? Like run or swim. So, and there's different kinds of actions. It could be like a whole sentence. So action category. Okay, going into number six. Okay, I'm gonna stand back. Ready? What do you guys think? I'll do some more. What am I doing? All right, number seven. Number seven, still in action category. So it's another action. Okay. Okay, this one might be a little harder if you don't know what this action is. So I'll do it one more time. All right, what did you think I was up to? What was my action? What was I doing? Number eight, we're on number eight. If you're following along, let me know in the comments what your guys' guesses are. I will tell you at the end what all of them were. Don't worry. All right, number eight is, um, so this specific action, I'm gonna warn you, sorry. This specific action isn't the first part, it's the second part of the action, because it, it'll look like two different things. Ready? Okay, so it was that last bit I was doing. I'll do it one more time. What do you guys think I was up to? 
Might be something you guys got to do often. Hmm. All right, number nine. Number nine. Do you guys think you have them all correct? All right, number nine. I'll give a hint in the middle after I do the first one. So see if you guys get it. Ready? What is my action? My hint is this was a part of a different Soar From Home video. Hmm. So I will do it one more time. What's your guess? And last but not least, number 10. You guys ready? Okay, number 10. What am I doing? What am I up to? What am I up to today? What's this action? All right, what's your guess? I'll do number 10 one more time. There's a lot of things I can do with number 10. Ready? Okay. Pause if you need to put final guesses down on your paper. Put your guesses in the comments. Okay, now I'm gonna go through and tell you in order what all of my charades were. How do you guys think I did it also? Let me know. I always like to improve so I can work on my acting skills. That's something fun and new I could work on during quarantine, right? We could all do that together. Okay, first one, number one was chicken. Did everyone get that from my head movements and my wings? And second one was a monkey. You guys figure it out from the, the arm scratching or the banana eating. Number three. I didn't really have anything else to do but the nose without having to like get on the floor, I guess. But number three was pig. Number four was airplane. Do you guys get that? Who's ready to get on an airplane and go somewhere with a beach or just somewhere different right now? All right, me too. But you know, again, one day we'll be able to do that. But right now we're doing our part, right? We're staying safe and healthy at home. That's what's important. Number five, we had some bracelet, right? I was looking at something shiny and I was putting it around my wrist. Bracelet. That one was a little bit complicated. So how did I do on that one? All right, number six, starting our actions. Number six, I was, what was I doing? I was itching. I was itching my, myself. Okay, number seven, I was sewing. Number eight, buttoning a shirt. So the first action, that's what I was telling you. I'm not, the putting on, if you put putting on a shirt, that's totally fine too. Um, but the card said buttoning a shirt, just letting you know. And number nine was hula dance, which we did three weeks ago, I believe. Um, we did a hula dance tutorial. So if you didn't see that, go check it out. It's in our videos. And number 10, we were lifting weights, which was also part of Friday's video. Oh no, Thursday's video last week, where we did some weightlifting with objects you could find in your home. And we worked out. I'm gonna send a sore smile shout out to all of our sewers for our service sew. We are still getting masks done. We are now over 500 masks that have been donated. Um, 
I'm waiting for a couple more to be donated and then I'm gonna drive around tomorrow and drop off more. We still have lots more to make, but I think that all of them are amazing. If I could shout out everyone single, every single name right now, I would, but it would be a long, long list of names. So believe me, they're gonna, rece they're gonna receive a really big shout out um, with all their names on it soon. Um, uh, but we want to thank them for their time and, uh, their sewing skills and their dedication to us and everyone in the Metro. So thank you so much for all of their hard work, keeping, uh, our community safe. Then I want to remind you guys, we've got a Mother's Day activity box. So if you're looking for a gift for mom or for a super female hero in your life, so someone special that's female that you think are is just awesome i've got those two options in one box you can choose the letters mom or hero but that is coming up soon you got to order by may 4th so so i can get it to you in time so you can make it for your gift get your orders in now and then we also have our friendly readers club open so go and get those now i also still have the clever card games and painting spring boxes open as well um, we did cancel um, because um, following governor's orders, we did cancel the last four May classes uh, of the spring and winter catalog. But believe me, I'm going to keep you guys busy. I'm going to keep making things to do, programs to run, and I will still be here every day making fun videos for you because I miss you. And later this week, we're going to try our first live. We're going to try that on Thursday. So we're going to do a lunch live, which means around lunchtime, we're going to do a live. And I'm going to send that out on Tuesday, the information for that. Basically, you just got to log into YouTube and our page, and you'll see the video, and you'll be able to click on it, and you'll be live. And you'll be able to comment to me live. You'll be able to type in, and I'll be able to see your questions, and we'll play games live and that'll be really fun. Everyone have a great day. Bye.